What's going on, King Grill TV? And as y'all can see, I finally hit a thousand subscribers. I want to say thank you, thank you, thank you. I know I look kind of bogus and my camera is probably fuzzy, but I just got home and I'll fix it later. So, man, this means a lot to me. And yes, I did. I had 4,000 watch hours way, way, way before I hit a thousand subscribers. So, I did just get, um, accepted to the youtube partner program so yeah man it's pretty cool but you know what i'm saying i just want to say thank you to each and every last one of you like i said in my community tab um make sure y'all uh just keep subscribing keep sharing and stuff make sure y'all let me go to my community tab as a matter of fact because i want to see well not i want to see but you know I feel like, um, click the wrong thing. Here it is. Y'all take some time and read that. Thanks for one case. I'm going to let y'all read it. I know it says members only. And I'm going to tell you why it says members only. Okay, I'll let you read it. So it says members only because when I had to, um, when I was setting up the monetization for the channel, um, it told me that I had to make a community post and make it members only. And that was like, I, I guess it was a requirement. I don't know. Um, so I did that and yeah, so I had just did that for, and I'm actually waiting on everything else to like come through so I can see like earnings and everything on past videos. I make a video on how, you know what I'm saying? For people who want to join the YouTube partner program and how to get there fast. Because I feel like the first six months of me doing YouTube, it was slow. Like, I gained, I gained a lot of subs fast. But once I hit like 600, it slowed down. I got to 600 subs fast. But... When I got to about six, I say like just a random number, I say like 6.30, it got so slow, it got so slow to the point where I went to Twitch and I got monetized on Twitch. And then when I got monetized on Twitch, I said, ah, oh, it's like the only thing I do on Twitch is play the game. I don't play the game every day like I used to. So let me just get back on YouTube. I got on YouTube and I started stream, well, not streaming on YouTube. I streamed a couple times on YouTube. I'm gonna start back streaming on YouTube though, but I started making, you know, reaction videos. And the reaction videos, it took me to a new level, you know what I'm saying? Cause I was getting about 10, 20 subs a day, but I feel like that's just stealing other people's content. So reactions are cool, but as you can see, like for mine, I'm just basic. I was basically just reacting, 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 reacting. When at first I was, let me see. If I could show y'all. At first, I was just... See, I was playing one-on-ones and just pranks, vlogging. Vlogging by myself with my nieces, doing pranks on everybody. But for the most part, it's reactions, 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 reactions. And uh, I just want to get back into, you know, vlogs and stuff. Because vlogging is, honestly, vlogging is fun. Like, this video was very fun for me. This video was very fun. This was very funny to me. Because she was pissed for real. But yeah, I'm not trying to, you know, well, I'm trying to promote my shit. Let me, let me, let me get that clear. I'm trying to promote it. But, you know what I'm saying? If y'all like the reactions, I keep doing them. But so far, for the like monetization and shit, that it's kind of, I don't know. From what I'm seeing now, it just seemed like it's, disappointed or annoying that every time you let me just show y'all i am I ain't gonna gatekeep shit I, i'm a real you know what i'm saying i'm one, I'm one of the real guys so let me just show y'all real quick so like for all of these are ineligible but for a lot of my past videos a lot of them are on but i don't know why i don't i guess i gotta, I gotta wait a little while like a day or two to see it but for the most of this content, like most YouTubers are lying and say that all their reactions, you know what I'm saying, 
or not blocked but a lot of my content is not blocked but i'll say like most i'll say like 30 percent of my content is blocked and then i just want to get away from that and um i just want to get away from that so i can have you know a successful youtube career now that I, it took me 342 videos to get to a thousand subs you know what I'm saying? And it, and it seemed like it's growing faster because I got 42 of those subs like within the last like four hours. Well, not four hours. I say like 10 hours, 12 hours. But it's pretty fun. I just want everybody to start tuning in to the vlogs and the pranks and stuff like that. I want to be like more of a giving back kind of YouTuber. Like, you know, I don't want to give away everything. Because I, I, I do want y'all to be like, oh, shit, he really doing what he said. So, yeah, it's like I'm just a little small YouTube, very extremely small. Um, And I just want to do that, like use my, like use YouTube for me as a platform to set up every everybody else. You know what I'm saying? So everything that I do on YouTube, hopefully... Like the younger, hopefully I get like a younger audience behind me because a lot of, I'm 24 and a lot of my views are like 18 to 24 and older. Like I think the majority of my channel is 65 years old and plus. No, that's like the second most. That's the second most because 18 to 24 is in my age. Um, yeah, man, I just... I don't know. I'm just happy right now. I actually screamed when I got a thousand subscribers. I was feeding my dogs, and I I stopped uh, screaming and there. Well, damn. I stopped feeding them and started screaming. See, I'm still kind of in shock because you know what I'm saying. I've been doing YouTube since what 2018. Let me let me backtrack. I was not. I I started YouTube in 2018. Let me see when I I actually that's cap. I'm capping right now. I'm gonna tell y'all the backstory. Y'all see this? This is the day I made a YouTube channel. This is the exact same channel that I made on my iPhone 3 that did not have a back camera. Wait, wait, wait. It had a back camera. It didn't have a front camera. And I made videos like this. The, the phone was facing, you know what I'm saying? And I was making videos like this and landscape. And I was just like recording the basketball practices outside after basketball practice basketball games everything and then people told me like in junior high school like man you funny you should you know what i'm saying take youtube more serious but i was in like the eighth grade and i thought for some strange reason i thought i was gonna be like six five and go to the nba because i was i was that good let me let me say that i was that damn good but you know stuff don't work out so that was in eighth grade. That was in what 20, 2012, 2013. So yeah, I was a 2013. That's when I became a freshman in high school, I believe. Yeah, so I was going to the ninth grade. I should have been in the ninth. No, I was still in the eighth grade. Yeah, I was in the eighth grade. Yep. Second semester of eighth grade year. Um, and then I ended up transferring schools. When I transferred schools, we had to, you know what I'm saying, drive a far distance and then, you know, we was in two Living in a different district, but going to school, you know what I'm saying, up top. So, and my mommy, she used to take our phones, so it was hard for me. Like, I couldn't, ne I could never edit video. I never had time to edit a video. I never had time to, you know, because I only had my phone when we were at school. It was turned off. When I got to school, I had to turn my phone off, keep it in my locker. Then when I got out of school, my mama had my phone. See, I wasn't thinking back then. Because my mama, she get off work at 5. So, I'm at basketball practice until 6. We got school at 4. She come get us. Well, come get me from basketball practice. So, 6 to 8, I'm in, you know what I'm saying? We go to, like, Walmart or something. They used to take hella. And then we still had to do homework. And then we had to eat. And then by 9.30, the phones was, you know, she take our phones, like, throughout the week. And then on the weekends, we didn't really have our phones like that. Because we was always doing something. Something that we didn't really need our phone. So we never was on our phone. And I wish I would have started back then and took it serious. But 
Come on, man. I was in. I, I didn't think about YouTube like that. I was in the eighth grade playing basketball. I was just thought I was the man. So you know what I'm saying? Then 2013. I keep saying 2013. So 2013, 2014, 15. I say like 2016, my junior year. Everybody was telling me like, man, you should start back vlogging, man. We're gonna have to look back on these memories in school. But which I did. I did start back vlogging. Where I feel that I was making all I'm talking about I made so 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 many videos. I edited them. I never posted them. The reason I never posted them, I had an iPhone 5 at the time. And every for some strange reason. And then I had got a job after that because I stopped playing basketball and started working. Um, and then when I had got my, like, the iPhone 5 was, like, plastic. So it was, like, every time I drop my phone, like, the screen will just go out. And then, like, I'll be editing the video and then I, you know, go do some, come back, drop the phone. Damn, my phone broke. So I'll be without a phone for, like, a week or two and then come back. Same thing, same process over and over and over until I got iPhone 6. That's... When I got my iPhone 6, that's when I posted my first video that is now deleted. Not archived or anything. It's deleted. On my own. Because I got videos on my mama YouTube channel. But I'm not going to show my mama YouTube channel because it's kind of embarrassing. But. um, Let me see. After that, I was posting like little pranks, blogs, and challenges and all that stuff. And then I just stopped. I don't know why, but like 2019, I just, like, I graduated in 2017. And then 2018, I didn't post none. And then 2019, I just did the channel. Like, I took every everything I had, like, every video, I took it exactly, I mean, I took it right off. That's why you see here, this has been my slogan since 2013. I've never changed this. Cause my channel is really whatever you make it like you want to see some reactions i got that you want to see gaming i got that you want to see vlogs pranks challenges i got that you know what i'm saying so because now i'm not deleting no more videos off i'm gonna keep it just how it is and we just gonna i don't know man hopefully one day we can get to a million subscribers that's my goal Hope I can, you know what I'm saying, cultivate everybody to subscribe to channel. But um, I want to touch one more thing. If I remember how to get to it, I don't remember how to get to it. So let me let me not even fake it. And I'm gonna like my own post because that's what I do. I'm gonna leave it right there. Um, uh, and yeah, man, it's like thank you for a thousand subscribers and hopefully we just keep going up and up and up and up. I mean, I can't really say nothing else, but thank you, thank you, thank you. Just from the bottom of my heart, you know what I'm saying? And I would have made this a vlog earlier, but when I came home, I had to do a lot of stuff with the dogs and stuff. Y'all know how that is when y'all got Rottweilers and stuff. If y'all got Rottweilers, make sure y'all subscribe to the channel because I left that out. I have a lot. I, have, I got dog videos on her too with me showing off my dogs. And this is my dog when he's a puppy, but he's not that small no more. And he just turned one last like two weeks ago so y'all send him a happy belated birthday but on that note man we're gonna i'm gonna wrap it up man i just wanna say thank you thank you thank you thank you can't grow out